ఓలండి Hello, welcome back to Rainbow Gaming. I'm Matt. I'm Chase. <laughs> welcome back to a new level of fucking sanity. <laughs> welcome back to Stardew Valley. The... what farming should be, I guess? What's funny is Jax, that's a guy just uploaded a video that... Talk, that where he mentioned this and the sad part is he's sitting there dogging and he's like, Oh yeah, let's just do this because of Stardew Valley rules. I'm like, hey, thank you! <laughs> I was like, thank you! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I remember saying that, and I just love the sh the the look you just gave me. Like, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I was like, it couldn't help it. I love the little sound that music. Like, yeah, I thought you would. You can't see it, folks, but I'm dancing my little heart. Oh right my now. god, you're shaking the let. Stop doing that because you're shaking the laptop a lot. That's not what I meant to do. That's not what I meant to do. Bye, motherfucker! <laughs> You're not that's doing your not, job well enough. That's not at all what I meant to do. I mean, if you Well, at least to... now you know how to pick up stuff. Like, well, scarecrows. Well, if we want to fire a scarecrow, we know how to do it now. Actually, I don't want her there. Stop. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I want her there. Uh, oh, God. <laughs> Are you sure you want this character to be there yes. this time? Are you sure? Yes. Are, are you going to fire him again? No. Are you? I'm. I'm sure. Okay. I'm just saying. Some medals. And all I can hear in my head is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life. Watermelon inside a watermelon. Oh, shout out to Aaron from Game Grumps. Good job on winning your match, dude. I see when I was when I first heard about the whole creator clash thing, I was like, okay, maybe just a video game, like a like you know the Grumps versus thing that they right, do, right? Right, right. No, I didn't expect a full on fucking boxing match. And the fact that he won was, you know, I was like, yes. <laughs> Plus, you gotta dig the shorts, the freaking sparkly pink shorts. Yes. Wear. Is it bad that I want a bear? No, I honestly, I, I didn't expect anything less from you, <laughs> to be quite honest. Did you notice how the picture, the pictures I had, the way they braided his hair to keep it out of his face? I actually did not. I, it, I wasn't really looking it was too like, hard. His braids going up like this on the sides of his head because his hair is long. Mm -hmm. I was just like, that's amazing. No. I'm sorry. You just punched me in the knee. I didn't mean to. I did not punch you. What the fuck? I didn't mean to. I thought you I, left me. I did, but gravity left my arm more and decided to pull it down faster. I thought you left me. Why I would did. you hurt me? Nah, it's like I ah! <laughs> I'm trying that to. That didn't help. That just felt weird. I thought that being. Ah! <laughs> what the hell? Stop. <laughs> As you wish. <laughs> I'm only trying. I'm only trying to help you feel better. It's just making it worse. It's not helping. <laughs> Oh, so, remember how we took the, so earlier today we took uh, May and Braley to the park, you know, so they could burn off some energy, because mm -hmm. this was the end of their spring break, yeah. and they go back to school tomorrow, Right. and um, when we went to the park, there was this woman, when she got there, she kept looking at me, just like, giving me like, weird looks, and at first I couldn't figure out why, and so I'm like, is this something I have on me, like, I'm sitting there thinking I'm wearing a Cabela's cap and I'm wearing a red shirt and as soon as I thought that I went wait a minute and I look on the left hand side and it says Luke Bryan's uh, 32 Rich because it's a shirt that I got from my parents from when they went there they cut, so they, it's a souvenir from his gift shop and the right. back of my shirt says take my trunk asshole <laughs> and I sat there just like oh no so she just kept on giving me like a look of disapproval every time she saw my shirt. We got another bread. Sweet. Out of the trash can. We ain't ate my nothing but maggot bread for three stinking days. <laughs> Lord of the Rings, motherfuckers. <laughs> but, um, what was funny is that at the same time, there was this couple <gasps> that, what, what did you grab? We got an octopus! How the hell did you get an octopus? 
Hey, look, it's Mario. <laughs> Stick the little red hat on him. And tell me that's not Mario. It is. Yeah, I know a lot about the people living here. It's one of the benefits of being a bartender. Sometimes I hear too much. <laughs> oh, you mean about, like, fucking, um, Lewis and Marty's affair? Wait, is Marty married? No. So technically, is it an affair? I don't know. How do you not know? I... 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 Cause I don't know shit, man. <laughs> I don't yeah. know. Jack, I'm only an elected official. <laughs> Disney, please don't sue us. We love you too much, please. I mean, we already have Disney Plus and everything, so please don't sue us. We're paying customers. But anyway, what I was saying was, at the same time, there was a couple with their son that, you, you know, the, the kid that kept on getting in the way where you and Braley almost beamed him in the head. Oh my god. Well, I actually did. I caught him with the merry-go-round. You did? Yes. When did that happen? He fell off. He, or no, he like launched himself off. And uh, he like launched himself off the merry-go-round and then fell backward and hit his head on it while I was spinning it. And I'm like, oh my god. Geronimo, oh, no. motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I like, I like panicked. I like panic stopped the merry-go-round because it was just Mela on it. Right. And um, the parents were like, he's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm like, like okay. Uh, all right. Well, what's funny is the dad, when he... He started looking at my shirt, too, at the same time, right? Okay. So I kind of turned around, like, intentionally for him to see it all here is, eh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was like, yeah, we're good. Okay, Harvey. <laughs> I'll get a moderate amount of something. <laughs> Just a moderate amount. Just a moderate it's amount. Just a I mean, he has to say shit like that because he's the doctor. So. A doctor? Yeah, he's, he's the town doctor. You know, doctors make the best criminals and serial killers, apparently. Did you ever hear about that one case where, like, a nurse was, like, killing all of her uh, patients by, mm -hmm. by injection? Yeah, and I think they actually made it into a Netflix film. I think. I... It wouldn't surprise me. Ooh. Yeah, I believe so because I believe it's called the nurse. Mm. Just the nurse. I'm. I might be wrong. Why does that not surprise me that it's so simply titled? Like, there is so many movies coming out now that are about like medical. I'm gentle little sunbeam woke me up this morning. I've never felt so refreshed. Okay. So he's a poet. <laughs> Didn't know it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry if that isn't very interesting to you. <laughs> Thanks, Fabio. But, um... Okay, you remember Hurricane Katrina and everything? Yeah. Well, there was an incident where people were trapped in this hospital for seven days. Mm -hmm. And apparently, they took matter... The, the hospital staff had to take mat took matters into their own hands. Mm -hmm. So this whole film is about it. And I actually went and looked it up. Like, what were the supposed crimes that they had committed? Right. And it is horrifying. Mm hmm And it's it, what's worse is like they believed that they were doing the right thing. Like they had no other choice. Yeah. I think that's the part that made me so uncomfortable because you have people that do stuff like that and they, you know, that try to justify their actions and you get what I'm saying? Yeah. Sweet pea. So what are we doing now? Foraging. We're just I'm just going around seeing what all there is to forage. Is um if we can just knock out the summer bundle today, which we can, I just picked up a spice berry and two sweet peas. So we can go put this up in the bundle and finish out the summer one. Oh, I told so something ha th another thing happened to me today that oh, God. Okay, so when I went to go drop Rayleigh off Right. She wanted me to stay so I could watch her bike. Right. This dude starts talking to me. Uh huh. And I'm kind of looking at him. He goes, She drives better than you. And I'm like, I don't. Ride. I'm like looking. Going, I don't ride a motorcycle. He thought I was Keith. <laughs> he has a long beard. And I'm just sitting there like, No. Like, No. Let's yeah, but Keith is like, what, 6'1, six, 6'2? Six, yeah. But you're, it was just you're like, like you're like what five nine? Yeah, five nine, five ten. 
Yeah, because you're you're taller than me, but not like a whole hell of a lot taller than me. I'm short. I'm not trying to say you're short. I'm, short. I'm, just, I'm not saying you're short. It doesn't matter if it's pretty or it matters if you're not short. Is. At least you're not as short as me. At least you're not as short as Ani. Oh my god. Dude, Can you imagine it? dating somebody who's uh, my aunt is like four eleven. She'll swear to God she's five foot flat, but she's four eleven. Well, no one you can tell that some of your dating is too small. When you have to actually bring a mushroom power up, to, so that way you can actually see them. That's <laughs> <laughs> totally not where I thought you were going with. That. Where did you think I was going with? That? I don't want to. <laughs> I can't be... say on YouTube. You, you can't say. I can't don't... say on YouTube. Okay. I don't want us to get. Band. Band. <laughs> Please no, we just started this. Yeah. Like literally we wait well no, we've been doing this it's for about been, it's been like a month. Yeah. Ta -da, we're done. Bloop bloop. So oh. no. And now we can go play these. Ah. Uh, okay, <gasps> what's going on? We're getting more. Are we getting that? Are we getting that? Oh my god, we're getting the blacksmith one. So we can go put a, um an earth crystal in this. Do we have an earth crystal? Yes, we do. It's right here. I still will say one of my favorite things I've heard so far is the Two Bears podcast. Yeah. <laughs> with with the daughter incident. The sad yep. part is, is I'm like, it's not surprising because it's a Catholic school. So for those of you who don't know, one of the guys, his daughter, he, while they're on the air, he gets a call from his wife. He says, your daughter's got in trouble. She got caught shooting dice <laughs> in a Catholic school. What is the, what was the, if you can find it, look it up. And it's, what's the most hilarious about the situation is the main dad is, I can't remember his name. He's like, just standing there like with that face, like what? And you can hear in the background in the production room, you can just hear this. <laughs> they are just dying, mm -hmm. not even trying to hide. They're just straight up dying. I just like the whole thing. Here, damn no motherfucker! What? We can talk to Sebastian. It's the man in black. Everyone is so happy in the sun. I don't get it. Yeah, I mean it, bro. <laughs> well, see, so you like almost internally combust. Uh, yeah, you know? yeah, I'm. For those who haven't seen pictures or don't know, I'm incredibly fucking pale, and I'm literally allergic to sunlight. So, if it takes like a normal person, like a few hours to get sunburnt, it takes me just minutes. Not even minutes. Like, it's it's pretty instantaneous. Here. Yeah, that's what I was about to say. Like, it's pretty much right there. And there. What the hell is that thing? Is that golem of some sort? Golem? No. Please stop. A mysterious and intelligent creature, yes I know. And delicious. They're so delicious. <laughs> so you found Cthulhu's little brother. Cthulhu! I am Cthulhu's little brother. <laughs> the cat fuck? was outside, just fucking teleported in here. My guy's already asleep. Yep. Whew. Uh, oh, these are spring. Okay. Uh, it's been a long day. I can't believe all we've done this past week. Mm-hmm. It's been a busy week. It has. But it's been quite nice. It has been. Now we have to go back to reality. What? Yo, I didn't know that octopus sold for that much in this game. Holy uh, shit. <laughs> keep on, go find some more. God damn. Day two of summer, year one. What year were you in year own? Because I know you have a diff you had your own um, account on The here. farthest I've gotten is uh, winter of year three. Can you plant anything during winter? Nope. Unless you get like... So, you see how we have summer seeds? Yeah. If you get winter seeds, you can plant them. But other than that, there's not really much to plant. 
still every single time you do that. <laughs> what? It looks like you're watering the lake. <laughs> ah yes, we need we require more pond. You wanna plant more here? Huh? You wanna plant some more? Yeah. We have 30 seeds to plant, my guy. We dig dig. Thirty seeds, huh? Yep. That's so it. Clay. And more clay. Yeah. And now you gotta water all of it. Yep. Have fun. Sorry, I just I'm just like sitting here watching you now. It's like <laughs> it's like damn, is it that's so fascinating. It is in a way. It is. I don't know why. It's just like like oh, this is actually kind of fun to watch. <laughs> I but, see why I'm so into it. Like watching a ship explode in the middle of the sea. It's, like, it's just entertaining. To watch. <laughs> I don't know what that. Means. What the fuck? I like watching History Channel specials where they show. Shit's getting blown up. I feel like that should be a cause for concern. Why? You don't you don't see how that could be perceived as a red flag. No, because I really don't do that. <laughs> no, if anything like if it involves farming or anything or anything to, like constructive in a way. I, I like <gasps> I just get glued into it. You know what I really love? What? You've ever seen like hoof restoration stuff? Yeah. Uh, oh you my me. god. I'm constantly fascinated by hoof restoration. I remember you showed me once and I just sat there, just watched it and you go, Are you okay? I'm like, yeah, I'm like I'm just it's just interesting. There's one that, like, particularly sticks out to me, and it's, like, like a whole half of a, a cow's hoof was just abscess. Mm. My favorite thing that I like watching is, like, the old school special effects. Mm -hmm. Like, when you have, like, the 1930s to 1970s, they would make these, like, elaborate models and stuff. Like, mm -hmm. the ships that I was talking about, those, yeah. that's what I was referring to. So they'll make these ships and whatever for these battles, for these war movies, mm -hmm. and then they'll blow them up. But what's interesting is when I watch it is like how much, how much detail went into these models for them to make just to yeah. get destroyed, unless yeah, yeah, yeah. just to get blown up instantly. Like when they showed Star Wars, like when they were making the X-wing fighters and the Tie fighters and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. You know, there was a lot of detail that went into these models, and then they would just go, "Ready, one, two, three, and just destroy it." And they would use that in the scenes to show them getting destroyed, like when mm -hmm. they were fighting the Death Star or whatever. Nowadays, I mean, yeah, there's still playing movies that use you know models and stuff like that, which I do like. I do like those movies that do that, but the majority of of that has been replaced by CGI and stuff yeah. like that. So it's like, it's a give and take kind of situation, you know what I mean? Yeah, I get you. Oh no. Now we have. For the love of God, how much clay does one man need? Apparently a lot. We have more seeds! Still concerned about me? Do I still raise red flags? Do you realize what I just did? What? When I did that, I did this. You're fabulous. I know, I am fabulous. <laughs> you have a fabulous ass, too. <laughs> 
sorry. <laughs> I have wow. I have absolutely no fucking filter. No, you don't. Uh, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Uh, let it be known for the record on YouTube that it's been said. <laughs> I can see the comments now coming in. And no, nobody else can see it. It's my ass to look at. Okay, this conversation took an entirely <laughs> different turn than what I was expecting in this video, but okay, we'll go with it. Welcome to this new special. Tonight's, tonight's subject, my ass. <laughs> did it, did it, did it. Actually, wait a minute. What the hell is that? It's food. It's food. It's field snack. Did you understand a word I just said? <laughs> the look on your face. I'm sorry. <laughs> Can I have some of the nerds? No. Hey. Right. No. Why are you gonna be so mean? Because I'm a bitch. It's in my nature. Oh my god, I fucking hate that. What? Oh my god, when you really, really have to sneeze, and then it just goes away. Oh wait, we have a crystal we can go put in, in, the, in the museum. No, the um bundle. Oh, Why do you dump them out into your hands? I've always done that. Weirdo. I should put my mouth on the box, I don't care. I mean, so they don't spill everywhere, they just go directly in my mouth. <laughs> just had to do this on Just had to do it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Yes. I had to. I have a float your boat. You float my boat. Yay. Which is a good thing because I don't float. You don't float? You don't float? Or I, float? You I, do. I do not float. I, 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 I can float like a rock. Okay. That's... A good analogy to put it in. I've told you about almost drowning. You did. You did tell me about that. I think the thing that perplexes me most about the fact that I almost drowned as a child like that is that Lisa was just like, I wasn't worried about it. That is just a disturbing statement. Did I? I did I not say that? You did. I'm, I'm just saying that that's still a very disturbing statement to say. You know what I mean? Yeah. I mean, I get where you're coming from with that. It's... I mean, like, that's... that's somebody that should probably give a shit about their kid almost drowning. <laughs> oh. What the fucking kind of sound did you just make? I made it sound like we just found a rainbow shell. Can that go in one of the bundles or something? No. What are you gonna do? Oh, and it's a gold star! Oh my god, that means it's worth more. Hello, dragon. Hello, dude, that looks like Cloud. Whoa! Talk about fucking Super Saiyan shit. <laughs> <laughs> hi, Goku! Oh, hi, it's good to see you again. Have we met? <laughs> oh, bye for now. <laughs> that was. I don't know. I don't... Literal definition of hi, bye. <laughs> right? Hey, what's up, guy? <laughs> Alright, so now what are you doing? Foraging. Let me see if there was like more coral or urchins to pick up, but there's not. More coral? So, we did talk about more games and stuff like that. Mm hmm. And one of the things I do have to say that we should play at some point, it, if we can find it, is the old school Pokemon. Since Pokemon is now, it's the, they've revealed that Ash and Pikachu are leaving Pokemon forever. We, we have, have 
Pokemon Red for the Digital Boy Are Advance. Are you fucking kidding me? You were the one to, to, to tell me to get it. I was? Yes. Oh. Well, then guess what we're going to play next time. Because... We were talking about it, and I was like, "Oh, the only uh, the only real Pokemon games that I played were um, Pokemon Snap for the sixty four and uh, Pokemon Go." Right. Um. So you were like, "Oh, can we get can we get one for the for the Game Boy, the emulator?" And I was like, "Fuck yeah, we can!" So that's that's the one that we got. We got a cape to play. Yeah. What are you going to use it for? I think you need clay to build the silo. Oh, uh, that makes sense. So, we need, yeah. Most of the time, I wouldn't really care about keeping it, because I just don't give a fuck. But, um, I'm trying to save up so we can get, like, the chicken coop and the silo and the, you know, this, that, and the other thing. What just happened? I don't know. So, day two. Is this the end of day two? Yes. Yeah, this was the end of day two. So now we're on our third day here. Yep, yep. Just make sure we don't go into an hour-long episode. Oh, like... there was an earthquake. Oh, no. That means probably some of our plants are dead. Oh, they're not! Nice! Oh! What the hell is this? This is embarrassing. I lost my lucky purple shorts. It's his boxers. It's Lewis's boxers. I'm you can find them. I'm telling you because I think I can trust you. If you can find them, bring them back to me discreetly. I'll pay well. Thanks, Mary Lewis. Really? Now we have to befriend Marnie. Uh, Actually, how close are we to Marnie? Not even a heart. Okay, so we gotta start... Be uh, nice to Marnie? Yeah, we gotta start talking to Marnie more. I, I would. Yeah, move into that specific spot. Yeah, there's a nine, uh, a nine square, like radius, um, that you can uh, water in. So you get the center. This, this, this. I love the music. It's interesting. The summer music makes me so happy. Uh, spring and fall are really relaxing, and the winter just makes me sad. Oh, we have no water. Yeah, you can need more. Yeah. There we go. Alright, so now we gotta go find more. Or befriend one. I thought we already did. Now that I'm thinking about it, but I, I we've guess... talked to Marnie, but it's not the same thing. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's like so. Have you ever? Um. Oh God, have you ever played like Harvest Moon games? No. I'm more into like oh, Far Cry, and okay. Ghostbusters, um, and so the thing about um, what's my name? Oh, well, fuck. Um, the thing about um, and this happens in Harvest Moon too. But the thing about uh, Stardew Valley is the more you talk to somebody, um, and not only do you get different dialogues, the more hearts you have with them, um. But, like, you have to, like, continuously, like, talk to them and bring them presents and stuff like that and everything. Right. In order to, um... Pay for the grass, or you can buy it from me. Of course, I can use the dash. Adios. Um, see, that's his shorts. So, we're not good enough friends with my name to go into her bedroom. Oh, lord. Did the kid, I was about to say, is the kid following you? So no. no. So what do you got to do now? We just go about our day. We just we have to talk to Marnie once a day to um Before get day. our yeah. How many hearts do you think you're gonna need? Before our... Two. You need to get two hearts uh, with someone before you can go into their bedroom. 
Really, of all things. <laughs> what? Just two hearts, that's all it takes. Yeah. <laughs> we got a chicken statue. Yay! The Lord of the McNuggets. It's a statue of a bronze chicken of a chicken on a bronze vase. The ancient people of this area must have been very fond of chickens. Apparently. No joke. What do you mean no joke? <laughs> There's like a million fucking fucking chicken that fucking. It's because I, <laughs> I say chicken instead of chicken. I'm my my brain. <laughs> but um no, if you, you keep consistently finding chicken statues all over the place, they must have really like their chickens. Hey, every culture has their own thing. Yeah, that's true. But... Hey card. Good to do. Uh, I can tell when I got to work tomorrow. All good? Good though. Yeah, I don't want to go into work tomorrow. The sad part is I know a bunch of people are gonna be like, it's great to have you back. Like, I don't wanna be here. I don't blame you. It's not that I don't like my job. I love my job and I love everything I do. It's just a highly, highly stressful job. Yeah. That's what it is. Which is like valid. Yeah. Feel that way. Like I said, I love it and I love the things that we do. I love the mission that we have and everything that we do is the, you know. But it's just like there's times where it's just like, why? Why does it have to be like this? Actually. How many rocks do you have? 450. And why do you have so many? Because you need them to build stuff. I'm actually going to say, let's go see. I think that's all you need to buy the chicken coop. The chicken coop? Yeah. See, now you got me doing it. I thought you were doing that just the, the... No. I don't want to say, like, to mock me, but to, like... What's the, what's the word I'm looking for? Connect with you? No, like a mimic. Oh. Have I ever mocked you? I don't think you've ever mocked me, per se. You just... <laughs> Give you grief. I was gonna say, you poke fun. Well, we poke fun at each other, so... Yeah. Uh, oh. 4,000. Do we want to do that? How much do you have? Uh... 5511. Uh, so I'll take a majority of everything. Yeah. But, I mean... That's, I'm gonna need it. <laughs> if we're gonna need it, might as well. Yeah. So usually I put it. Oh, that's real close. It is real close. And that's usually what I do. Is I put it kind of close. Actually. Do, 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 do. Where should we do? Um, I'm trying to think of where we should put it. I would just put it right next to the house like you had a second ago. Like right here? Yeah. I'm gonna move it down. There we go. Okay, I'll start working on your new coop first thing tomorrow morning. No! Get started now, damn it! I just gave you 4,000 fucking gold coins! <laughs> Let me go ask I my wonder, friends. Uh, I wonder oh. oh, this is cleared up! What? Woo! What is this? Alright, so this has the railroad crossing. Okay. <gasps> there's a- oh, there's more! <gasps> oh my god, there's more- there's- 
No, no, you're not understanding. This has to be like an update because before this wasn't here before. Oh, okay. Oh my god. Oh my god, there's more! I've been in here. In the one on my phone. And oh my god, it is interesting. Although you wanna see you wanna see what the my my favorite interesting thing is? What? This is a bathhouse. Nice. Okay, so I want to point out something, and I know you're going to tell me this. So in the video that we were watching with Jack Sip, the guy, the game that he's playing, pretty much has the same basic concept and rules for, um, for, like from Stardew, right? <laughs> Trying to share with the clothes out. Oh lord. <laughs> right. Right. But in the game, it's the same basic things. Like you have to take care of your own stuff. But oh, oh, by the way, since you're here, can you help us with this? And can you help us with yeah. that? And it's the same thing I thought. I'm like, why is it your fucking problem? Why do you have to be the one that fixes up the freaking, uh, that one building? You know what I mean? This locker smells awful. Well, it's a gym. <laughs> what did you expect? <laughs> oh, wow. Nice subtlety. But it's like, you get what I'm saying though, right? You have to worry yeah. about your farm. But you have to worry about helping everybody else out and doing this for the town and doing that for the town and then doing this and doing that. I'm like, I, why is it your freaking problem? I really sincerely do not like how slow you are in this. Oh, this is an. Oh, this is interesting. Are you the only one that's here? Yeah, but I don't like how slow your movement is. It's, Why? Just, it's unnerving. Oh my god, I didn't realize that you could get out of... Oh my god. That's fascinating. You can get out at any time? No, at the break in this. I had no I idea am, you could get out of... I have this. never been to a bathhouse. Honestly. I haven't either. I... I have friends that have been to bathhouses and stuff, and they tell me it's an, it's an awesome experience, but it's like, I've never been to one. Mm. I don't know the etiquette for that kind of thing, you know what I mean? The, the thing about, um, because I was uh, trying to look at, um, like, the etiquette and everything for um, the, um, the onsen in Japan, but one of the things is, like, you can't have tattoos. with Yep. I've read that. I'm like, that's... I there's feel... Actually, there's actually quite a few places that aren't just bathhouses. There's, like, actual, like, outdoor venues and stuff like that. If you have tattoos, they, they will not let you in. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, um, you know why, right? At least yeah. in Japan. Yes, I am very well yeah. aware. I'm just not going to say it here. <laughs> <laughs> because my luck, I'd say it, and then all of a sudden, you know? Yeah, um... But I think I read somewhere that it's a little more, like, lenient towards, um, like, people who are visiting, um, from other countries where, like, tattoos are more commonplace. I remember growing up, you know, like, only, like, bikers and sailors and stuff, people like that were the only ones that had tattoos. Now it's become part of the norm, like, everybody has tattoos. I <laughs> I think it's funny because um, I grew up... So I was raised mostly by my, my grandparents, mm -hmm. right? My grandma was very much so... Um, the uh, <laughs> She was like, please, 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 don't, don't ever get tattoos. Like, she never wanted me to have tattoos. I'm like, well, about that. <laughs> but, um, <laughs> but then she passed, and I'm like, I need a giant wolf tattoo for her. <laughs> well, you got the you got the death ear one, so. Mm hmm How much more you want to play? Do you want? To... Do you want to do another day, and then we'll call it. Uh, or should we call it now? I think we should call it now. Okay. Alrighty. 
The only reason I'm saying that is because it's getting late. Yeah, it's yeah. almost 11 at night. We yeah. gotta get some rest. Yeah. But, actually, do we... I actually like like watching you play this game. Especially, like, you know, with everything. That, because of all the new things you tell me about, like, the game and everything. It, it's just interesting. I, I really do like yeah. it. I did give it shit when it... When we when, start... Yeah, first, when we first started. Yeah, but I was... And I was doing it just to mess with you too, and I feel like a dick doing that. But this is actually a pretty interesting day. <laughs> but, um, you know, thank you guys so much for tuning in uh, to Stardew Valley again on Rainbow Gaming. If you like this video, and if you have any other, uh, you know, games that you'd like to recommend us playing, please leave a comment in the comment section below. Uh, so, you know, like and subscribe to our channel. Um, we also provide links for um, our Twitter, our Instagram, and our TikTok account. So if you would like to check those out, please do so. Um, before we go, do you have anything else you'd like to say? Anything? No. That's about it. Well, like I said, thank you, much, thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. And I'm Matt. I'm Chase. And we'll see you in the next episode. See ya. Bye.